does the post stream have to be on this console? No, it's fine if it's on PC as well, or it can be on... I see some Kega Fusion sitting down there on your desktop, which means we could do Indeed some... You do. Gen we could play some Genesis games if you have a full set, or at least partial set. Well, I think I do have a partial set at least. At least the good ones. Pretty much. Play some Sonic. Oh god, no. <laughs> <laughs> of all possible games to ask for, you ask for Sonic. Get out. Get out of my head, Charles. Walter Beast. Oh god, no. Oh well. This is uh, the final game on the stream, and it's over. Thankfully, it actually lasted for 18 minutes. I'm terribly sorry about that. I hope I will never have to repeat that again. And, uh, yes, well, we can uh, move on to our post stream, either on PC, or we can do it on the Genesis, or we can try a, one of the CD games we've been playing. One of the CD games we've missed, actually. I'm up for pretty much anything, really. It comes down to what the stream wants to see. They are just silently sitting there staring blankly <laughs> at the screens. Like we have no idea. Just give up already. We only watch this out of obligation anyway. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we have to come here. John Amadeus rolls a die and he gets a TurboGrafx CD game. Hmm. Well, that will really extend the stream. The question is then, what manner of CD games do I actually have accessible at the moment? Let's see, I know there are some that I didn't actually play during the uh, last stream because they were weird but not quite weird enough. Which means that they were pretty damn weird, but, mm -hmm. you know, not that weird. I also have this strange game that I got a hold of out of nowhere that I literally have no idea what it is. But it has a really, really long name. That's basically the... I have no idea what that is. Yeah. <laughs> you can barely read it, but you still have no idea what it is. Brandish. I remember that. Brandish is a good game, yeah. But in any case, we have a game called Yamamura Misa Suspense Kinsen Kake Ezara Sasujin Jiken. I don't know what that is. Me neither. So let's play it. Alrighty. Let's see what it is. I have no idea. So, stream chat, if this turns out to be an absolutely horrible game, Blame me. <laughs> Blame everyone. Except me, because I'm innocent as always. Right, this is the end of the uh, standard stream then, but I'm going to record this as well, actually. Which means if we are below 16, get your parents' consent to watch. Because time gets Pretty spicy. Much. Spicy all. Huh, apparently its name within the system is different from the uh, name of, well, that is on the package. Hmm. Alrighty then. Let's see what the heck we, oh, heck that's soft. That does not bode well. <coughs> Japanese text tells us nothing. A keyboard with nothing but L characters. That is the worst keyboard ever. <laughs> so far, how so good. How do you even write on that? I don't know. That is a very tall nose for that face, lady. If it is a lady, I don't know. It's completely flat and has pretty wide shoulders.
The sound seems to be a bit on the low side. Uh, let me know, Stream Chat, if you can't hear it at all. Uh, yes, I have. I know it. <laughs> I turned it down, but I'm. I still want to know if you can hear it now. Come on. Oh, hey, it's that place. Uh, what's it called? Uh, that's a really famous temple. And more sushi. So is anyone following what the heck is going on right now? She's walking around town eating sushi, apparently. Let us bring the sound up. Maybe she can explain to us in English what's going on. Actually, that would be the raddest game ever. A food critic game. I would like that. I would like that a lot. It would be awesome as hell. There we go, I've upped it just a little bit, hopefully that's enough. And oh hey! Zen garden and everything, and oh hey! This time it's uh, steamed dumplings with rice. And that's the, ah, uh, uh, what's it called? The HHH uh, -H -H something temple. A mysterious plate, perfect for eating all my food off, since I have literally eaten five meals before lunch. Mm-hmm. That oh. woman is just a black hole. Well, so far as trying to make himself into a anime. Wow, he they, they actually gave us a wooden box to bring home a single plate. She must have paid through the nose for that one. But little does she know that the plate is cursed. And suddenly zombies. Lots and lots of food zombies. Sushi. We're walking along the river, du -du 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 -du. and the sakura are in full bloom. Oh, isn't that wonderful? Mm -hmm. What's going on? Oh, and the game started over. Okay. You didn't even bring me back to the main menu. You just started over. Well. Wow. Right, so let's actually press the run button and see what happens. Okay. It looks like this is indeed an adventure game of some sort, so let's start a new game. Well, here's a clearly non traditional building. Blah 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 blah, we don't care who you are because we don't understand the word you're saying. Fill in the blanks. Let's see how quick we can get a bad ending. I really love in these games where there are literally two choices after one choice. You have a choice of one thing and one thing only, and then after that you get two choices. Why not just have two choices from the start, if I can't do anything else anyway? And now we're wearing a very form-fitting red dress all of a sudden. Where is something, something, something? There are some things everywhere, the receptionist tells us. Plenty of some things. I had to go back to my room and check that no one had broken in, because that's what happens in these things. Does anyone know what's yeah. going on? She's uh, see, she's a food critic. Let's go with that. She's a traveling food critic, and she has come to this hotel to check its hotel restaurants. 
Sounds good. Keep talking, lady. Keep talking. Let me know where the restaurant is, damn it. Maybe it's outside. I wonder if we actually get a controller and walk around. I sincerely hope so. Oh, hey, look at that. Hey, you. What's wrong with your face? Wow, she even bows before she starts speaking to him. They mentioned a party. Hey, maybe, maybe we are invited to a food party with lots of food. Hopefully, maybe, maybe. Let's walk her over here. Oh, hey, T T T T T T T T T T T T T. Give me the tea, lady. You know you want it. What do you mean? What do you mean? No, Gra grab it. G ah, fine. Oh, hey, you can speed up. Wonderful. Let's speed walk a bit. Got a hustle. And look at that—an actual scrolling screen. High tech. Let's see. There must be food in these. Food. food, food, food. <laughs> fine food. Eat. Excuse me, Miss uh, Lady. I am uh, talking to you. Where do you keep the rice? I need it for my side dishes. Curse your questions, woman. Hand over the goodies. And by goodies, I mean meat, well, both beef and fowl. She clearly has no food. What's down here? Mm -hmm. Nothing there. Pick up. Oh, hey, this guy looks a bit more to my tastes. He's fat. That means he has food. Excuse me, sir. Would you mind sharing your uh, food? Lunch? I mean, you clearly brought enough for two, at least. Judging by the width of your face. But, hmm, wait a minute, this is a pavilion. People eating those. Oh, you son of a bitch. You're not even going to let me know, are you? Uh, I am the only Japanese person who enjoys the international cuisine. Belgian waffles. Swedish meat was a carp, 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 carp is delicious. You just jump in face first and Here, grab carpy, the fish. Carpy, carpy, carpy. Here, carpy. Did you know that the word for carp in Japanese is koi? But koi also means love. It also means get over here or come at me, depending on intonation. This has been Japanese lesson with Arthur D. Wolf. Oh hey, a samurai. You are a samurai, that means you have rice. I like that for some reason she did not bow to the samurai. She has bowed to everyone dressed in western gear, but the moment she sees someone actually dressed in traditional Japanese clothing, she just walks up with her hands on her hips and says, yeah, what's she gonna do about it? Oh, hey. Maybe they're trying to eat him. Can I, uh, can I go in? Have a, have a leg or something? You just maul them and start to eat their faces off. What is wrong with your nose, sir? It seems to be going in one direction and one direction only. 
to the left. His left. We're still fattening him up, they say. Oh, well. Make sure to feed him plenty of alcohol. That may actually that actually makes the meats more supple out here. Because they're hammered. John Amadeus informs us that uh, the reason for his slightly misaligned nose is because it helps him smell food from the left, so he most likely works in a kitchen. Let's see, what's I here? Ah, oh, there's nothing in there. Ah, let's go back into the hotel, maybe. No? No? Apparently we have something we need to do here. But what? I do not know. Maybe someone has misplaced a lunchbox somewhere. Come on, give me the tea! Give me the tea! Seriously? Is the food served yet? No? This is the worst hotel ever! I've been walking around for like... several minutes and I still haven't been- <gasps> Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. The lady that was talking about the strange ghost earlier. She's been eaten. She's been eaten by a ghost. Now it turns into Pac-Man. Maybe there's something in there. Where did she go? Where did she go to? Oh, hey, look at this guy. Where did you appear from? You look delicious. His favorite anime character is Haruhi, apparently. He also dyes his hair blue. <laughs> Clearly is a kindred soul to our dashing protagonist. Because she also likes anime aimed at teenagers. Get over here, cop. Uh, they can smell her bloodlust. Every time she approaches, they flee. Hunger is getting worse. The desire is ever present. Come on, Patso, have you opened up yet? Ah, still not open. Seriously, can something happen or something? A murder? Anything so that people are pulled away from where they keep the food? That would work out beautifully. Maybe there needs to be a murder. Hmm. Caused by you. I never said anything like that. I just mean, you know, what if someone was murdered? Just what if? And people would uh, center on the victim, right? Yes. And that means that what is left unguarded? kitchen. Alright bitch, I've asked you twice for tea. I'm not going to ask you a third time. You'll hand it over. Uh, come on lady, I'm thirsty and hungry and I have been walking in high heel shoes for like two hours. Come on. Please just tell me that it's time to go inside. How many times do I have to speak to everyone anyway? A Maybe billion. Nothing new to say. Nothing new to say, so let's go to those businessmen. Maybe they'll have something to say. I feel like I'm missing something. And by missing something, I mean I don't speak Japanese. I'll talk to you one last time, just in case. 
And apparently that did unlock a new conversation option. I love adventure games. Why is your background purple anyway? Does it mean that you're evil? Maybe. Maybe. Alright, let's head back over here and then we can head to the left and see if that lady is back. If anyone is back. Maybe someone's dropped a donut or something. Nope. Come on, I'm diabetic. I need to eat properly. ところで、私に何か用があったんでは。あ、はい。奥様があなたを探しでした。いや、わざわざすいません。そのうち姿現すでしょ。He apparently had something to say, but we can't quite translate it. So, I feel that the only thing your guy is saying is food, 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 food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might as well be, uh, I think. Why do you have a dot on your forehead anyway? You're not Hindu. Can't fool me. So, that guy I'm continuously talking to over there. Is he related to you somehow? Maybe? No? Can I eat him? And how about you? Are you done killing him yet? Come on, you've had him surrounded for like 30 minutes. Why isn't the sped up walk the normal walk anyway? Come on, obey me! Someone has run away. Hmm. Maybe they were afraid of getting eaten. Ah, the preparations are complete. It's time to eat. Finally. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is A great stuff. Oh yeah, look at this, look at this. Oh my god. Mm, let's see. Food. We have uh what do we have? We have Ebisu over there, fried prawns. We have a uh, rolled egg. I believe that some tomcats are there over there as well. Some high grade cuts of shimi. Nice. So, they fried prawns. How are they? Apparently, she believes thinks this is completely delicious. Alright, how about uh, the prawns? Hmm. This was apparently a weak spot. Hmm. Keeping up on things. How about the soup? It has some really expensive mushrooms in it. Oh, that's nice. I know how to bribe properly. And how about the sashimi? Mm, it's a Kyoto specialty. Mm -hmm. And this, I'm not even entirely sure what the hell it is. She seems to enjoy that as well. And uh, oh no, we have spilled food. Or blood. Hope that's not blood. That's blood. That's blood. Excellent. While everyone's looking away, grab all the bento boxes, put them in a stack, and run to the room. 
Go, go, and go, 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 go. Just lock the door, place it in a circle around you, place a spinning chair in the middle, chopsticks in both hands, then spin the chair and eat like a madman. Well, it seems that someone fucked up when carving the fugu. Also, her hair was green, so I believe she was some sort of sea hag. She might have seen someone wearing a religious symbol and just spontaneously died. It does not necessarily have anything to do with the delicious food, the food that I'm obsessed with, the food that I know everything about, that I watched being prepared in the kitchen. I am completely innocent, by the way. Yes. Seriously, I, I bet that is going to end up being the plot twist, that we actually poisoned that bitch because she was holding out on us. She made brownies, everyone got one except us. And that's why we're so pissed off. Well, this detective clearly has a lot of interesting things to say, such as we are looking into the case and do you remember everything and blah, 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 blah. and we are going to have to solve the entire case on our own. Because the kitchen is apparently closed until this whole poison in the buckle has been solved. We'll call you we'll call you if we hear anything, blah 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 blah. You know Yas as well as I do. She died because she didn't show f the food enough respect. Seriously, a food-based detective series would be pretty awesome. I once wrote a novel about a detective that uh, used this extremely sensitive and trained sense of smell to help solve cases, but uh, maybe taste is a better idea. You, know, you can just take a swig of all the poisons he finds. Nom 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 nom. Quite fruity. But try. Ness Lover probably has said the lady was probably a mermaid who turned into a human and accidentally committed cannibalism by eating carved mermaid flesh, after which she killed herself in horror. Well, that's, uh. I don't know. That's an interesting Freudian slip there, Smokey. I'm not entirely sure how you mix up necrophiliac and cannibalistic, but uh... Will you please allow me to leave already? I'm getting hungry just watching you blather. I'm not actually listening to anything you're saying. I mean, I'm thinking about hamburgers with steakhouse fries. Nice side of freshly sliced tomatoes. A cold draught beer to it. Take it all down there. If you still have questions for me, just ask them. I think that I have used all of them. Oh, okay. It updates the questions. You have to re-ask questions once you've asked other questions. Man, I love that stuff. Just give me all the details in one go, please. Yes, Japanese man, you have a lot of things to say. Can I go now? Blah, 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 blah. Seems that we are being allowed to walk now. 
And they want us to stay at the hotel. Come on, we can't stay at the hotel. Someone died from eating the food. How do you think I could possibly stay there? This is going to kill my appetite. I'm going only going to get like seven or eight meals a day at this rate. <sighs> oh hey, sushi restaurant. Perfect. Let's head inside and see what we can get. I had a brush with death earlier today. Give me your best slices of fugu. And by that I mean all the fugu you have. Literally every single blowfish. カレンドラ murder dish to today. Ah, that pretty fitting title. Yeah, I bet that this lady has probably developed such sensitive taste and excellent teeth control that she could probably take a blowfish. Just dip it down into her mouth and then you hear <laughs> Then she'd pull out the tail, the spine, the bones, and the poison sack. Everything else would be gone. I do not doubt it for one second. <laughs> Seriously though, this is getting really long in the tooth. My appetite for shitty games is almost filled up. Shall we Yet try I'm a new game? For something more. Try something that we understand what's going on? I suppose... If your taste is English games, then that's what we'll have to do. Huh. I don't mind if it's an English game, I just want to, you know, know what the heck is happening. Hmm. Well, maybe we can save state here. I don't know if we can. Oh, you can. Wonderful. Let's save a state here as file one. We can come back to that later.